Hello, Wolfpack, and welcome to Moss Book 2. I am so excited to be back in this world because Moss is one of my all-time favorite VR games. It has that classic Zelda-style combat and exploration. It has these beautiful worlds that you get to live in. And most of all, it has a connection to that little mouse right there. An emotional connection that drives your relationship and brings you into the story. And I am so excited to see how they build on that in the sequel. The original Moss came out four years ago. And like that game, the sequel is a PlayStation VR exclusive, as you can see by the controller. It will be coming to other systems, we just don't have a timetable on it. But we are going to experience some of that classic PlayStation VR tracking, where the world just wobbles. Now normally I would summarize the story of the first game for you, but this game is actually going to do that for us. But if you haven't seen my playthrough of the original Moss, I recommend you do it, because this game starts right as that game ends. Without further ado, let's go say hi to Quill once again. Oh, this is so exciting. We remember you, dear reader. Even if you do not remember us. No, I do. You see, this is no ordinary book. Within these pages lives a hero. One who could determine all our fates. Aw, oh, you flatter me so. She needs a reader who knows just how important they truly are. Shall we begin? Yes, please. I've been waiting so long. Let's do it. Oh, all right. That's the trail we took, and here we go. Every war in Moss begins and ends with the Five Glass. And on the Cinder Night, the Arcane tried to take them all. Sir Argus, commander of the Kingsguard, sacrificed everything that night to ensure the King's Glass was safe. The Sprites, too, had their own glass to protect, and their great champion did so until his final breath. Aww, those poor Sprites. The story of his glass would resume much later when young Quill of the Clearing, out on one of her humble adventures, found what the Sprite Champion concealed in death. When she showed her Uncle Argus the green glass, everything changed. He understood well the gravity of her find, and rushed off to seek counsel with the Sprites. Atop his mighty squirrel steed. I ride the squirrel! But Argus was captured by the Arcane, and so the starving Aduran came to Quill with a promise to lead her to her uncle. Quill knew of starthings only from campfire tales of magic and mischief. Yet still, she decided to follow. Quill knew her uncle needed her, but not just her. You see, Quill was bonded by the glass to a reader, a soul whose gifts proved the perfect complement to the young hero. Together, they were twofold. Yeah, we were. We were so close, Quill. I'm excited to, to meet you again. They embarked on a perilous journey. Yeah, we did. The Arcane's pursuit was relentless, and Quill barely survived. A Durin, who had become a friend of sorts, was not as fortunate, ending up in the jaws of Sarfog. Oh, a Durin. Sarfog was the Arcane's most ruthless general, and at the very gates of the castle seized on that cinder night, the two fold heroes slayed the monstrous serpent and rescued Argus from captivity. We did. We really did. We were such heroes, Quill. But the Arcane do not end with Sarfog. The one who leads them will not relent until the five glass are in their clutches. And that will unravel this world. Our fate rests with Quill. She needs a true partner by her side. And we hope that is you, 
dear reader. Oh, it is. I will be the greatest hero so this land. Okay. So let us begin okay. at the castle. Sure. Where Quill and her uncle must brave the arcane to retrieve the king's glass, still hidden away after all these years. Or so they hope. Done, done, done. Look at the door. There are some evil eyes there. Ugh. Oh, Sarfog. Uh, what is that? A Durin? Is that you? You're alive. Oh, Ghostface? Hey, buddy. You're still here. Then you should have this. Um, yes, please. I will take any and all gifts. Oh, I that, well, later. okay. Well, maybe before. Who knows? That's, um, that's a little small for me, though. So I can't even pick it up. A Durin, I didn't really like your gift. Oh, my God. Will searched the castle entrance Quill. for her uncle's sword. He'd insisted they'd never reach the king's glass without it. Look at... Quill was shocked to find it hiding in plain sight. She must have missed it last time around. You're beautiful. I missed you so much, Quill. Your little green arm, your cool sword, your backpack, and that scarf. After Hi. all, she'd been a bit preoccupied. Yeah, I would say the whole murdering a giant snake thing. Uh, you're doing a little Italian hands there, huh? Together, we can accomplish anything said Quill, looking up to her reader. Heck yeah, we can. I couldn't have defeated this monster without you. Thank you for being here with me. Of course. Uh, high five. Yes. Oh, I am in love with you again. You're my best little friend. She left What's Uncle that? Argus alone for too long. He could be in grave danger. Well, Quill, we better get back there. Can I control you now? Oh, yeah. So you have control of Quill with the uh, controller here. How do I dodge? There it is. Uh, and then you also have your little hand here. The world is beautiful. Now look, the PlayStation VR is not the most advanced headset anymore, but everything in this game looks really clear, really beautiful. I want to jump on Sarfog and stab him a few more times. That rascally snake. Uh, okay, we should probably go save our uncle though, huh? Oh. They had to hurry. Her poor uncle was too injured to defend himself should the arcane find him again. These worlds are beautiful. They are so stunning to sit inside in virtual reality. And even though it's third person, you just, you feel so immersed. All right, we got to get to our uncle. Uh, make sure there are no secrets because those are everywhere and you just have to look around. Oh, the giant squirrel mounts. If we don't ride a squirrel in this game, I'm going to be severely disappointed. Like, why even tease me with these amazing creatures if we can't even ride them? Let's go, Quill. You're wasting time. We got to save our uncle. How deep into this castle did we go? Let's go up here. There's a stick we can break. Yeah, take that stick. Okay, big jump. Nice, Quill. You still got it. Oh, wait, I can grab this. Bring it out here. See? Thank you. Thank you for that thumbs up. We are such a good team. Quill and the reader. Uh, oh yeah, we have to get all the glass, which means I have to jump down here. Excuse me, we gotta break some pots. Don't forget that chalice, Quill. Come on, you can... All right, fine, we'll forget about it. Up, up, and away. Let's see, how did we get to him? Obviously, we can move that. Not entirely sure where. Can you, can you make that jump, Quill? Yes. So strong. Uh, now there's a scroll up here. Oh, didn't even know I could do that. Not sure how we get that. I like this mouse statue here. Make sure we break everything. Gotta get all them secrets. All right, where are we going? We have to get somehow up there. Oh, I have an idea. Okay, we're gonna bring this over here. Quill's gonna jump right up there. And then we're gonna bring it. Yep. And then Quill's gonna do some sweet hopping. Now you stay right there, girl. Yep, a little wobbly, isn't it? Are you surfing? Oh my god, Quill, you're the best. I love you so much. Okay, now you jump here. Uh, and then can you 
Perfect. Nice. Such skill. Step on there. Okay. Okay, good. We can bring this over here. And that will keep... Oh, that is such a good dance. You are such a good dancer. Get up here because we got to get these pots and then we got to go grab that scroll. Nice. I love all of her animations so much. We did it. We got a scroll. I don't remember what those do, but I also have a trophy. Quill, I'm so proud of us. Uncle Argus. We made it. Quill was relieved to find him safe. You found my sword. You wouldn't believe where it was. You know, I never realized just how huge Sarpog was. Shh. Lower your voice, Quill. Why? Is there an enemy here? We're not safe. He could be anywhere. Who is he, Uncle Argus? The king's glass hides beneath the throne. We must move quickly and quietly. Duh. Quietly, Quill. I forgot we had that grass blade. So cool. Your reader. Are they still here? Hey. Yes, Uncle. They're oh right my God, by it's my me. Side. Hey, what's up? How you doing? I'm We're the reader. Twofold. We aren't afraid of the arcane. That's right. We're not. I see. He said with a hint of pride. <clears throat> now, keep your ears open and your sword ready. We must get to the throne. Well, easy enough. Ah, look at me. Ooh, I'm so blue. Just chilling here in the mirror. I like my spirit mask that I got going on. All right, Quill, before we go anywhere, we have to destroy this room. The throne room of our ancestors, taken over by these giant creatures that apparently want all mice dead or something like that. All right, I think that is everything. Perfect, perfect. Anything, uh, anything I can do? Oh, literally, yes. I'm going to open the gate. Kind of a creepy noise when we opened that. Sorry about that, everybody. I might have unleashed an evil upon our world, but that's okay. We'll be fine. After you, uncle. Ugh, he's so old. Yeah, you, you chase along with him, okay? Hey man, if you need to take a rest, don't worry about it, okay? No sign of the arcane here. That's what worries me. Oh no. What was that? Uncle, look out! Hello? Oh shoot! Oh god! I heard a bird! Quill, what happened? I see you, but I know you're up there, Rita. Hi. Please. She's in your hands now. Oh, don't worry, Quill. I got you. Get up here. Yeah, you're safe. Quill, Aww. you're far too important to risk yourself for me. The greater good must always come before matters of the heart. Yeah, what he said, Quill. Quill. didn't understand. He was our family. He'd always come first. But she knew better than to argue. Yeah. Free the old monk mouse over here. This game reminds me of Redwall so much, and I think there's actually a Redwall TV series that's in production, which I would just be so ecstatic if it was good, because that was like my favorite series as a kid. I warned you this sword belonged to my father. We're up here, we're gonna throw a switch. That's right, Quill, grab that. You're so strong. You're such a strong mouse. Yes, you are. Oh, you're such a good girl. You see what I did, Uncle Argus? Go on ahead. I'll stay a few steps behind. No, 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 no. We have to focus on getting to the throne. Okay, but I, I have to protect you. And I can't protect you if you're very far behind me, Uncle. You be safe now, Uncle Argus. Come on, Quill. We got a job to do. You okay, buddy? Yeah, alright. Okay. Oh, we have a scroll. I love these worlds. They're so beautiful, Uncle. Uncle, that's a bit more than a few steps behind, dude. Ah, he'll be fine. Oh, I have a bad feeling about what's gonna happen when we drop down here, Quill. Yep, the music is telling me. And the red fire is... Oh! Okay, enemies. Let's see if I remember how to do this. Good dodge. I'm incredible. Quill, we are an unstoppable force. 
Was that it? Just one? Here we go. Okay, now I can do something too. I can like control them. And then Quill can finish them off. What a team you and I are. Oh, two at once? That's fine. That's fine. We are dodging. Boom. Boom. Dodging. Oh. Y'all thought Elden Ring was the new hot shit with all the dodging? Nah. Nah, son. It's Quill. Me and, me and Quill. How you doing? Good job, buddy. Good job. I'm so proud of you. Oh my god. You're so cute. Alright. Is there anything else that we can do? We have to run back and get that scroll. That is for sure. Up, up, up. Nice. There is no way that I'm going to do a completionist run of this. We are going to forget things. I am not going to see things. I've never been really good at that, but I always try to find them. So we will definitely keep attempting because it's fun, man. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm kind of worried about our uncle at this point. He's really not following along with us. Hey, buddy. Okay, I remember if I move you, I can keep you right on there. Looking good, looking good. How you doing? Just coming through. Don't mind me. I love all the glass. Oh, and there's a scroll. Nice find. Good job, Quill. The whispers. Look at there's like a little mouse statue up there. I, I just want to keep looking around at stuff. Oh, he's dead. That's a murdered mouse. That's a mouse skeleton. Actually, that's really upsetting. Oh, I don't like that nearly as much. Maybe we won't look around as much anymore, Quill. Ooh. Freaky. Let's get out of here. There's like a weird rumble in the world. Definitely something very large and very in charge in there. Uh, can we move this out of the way? There we go. Step on that. Alright, so we're gonna have to get that bar out of the way somehow. Get all that sweet, sweet glass. Then I'm gonna bring you around here. Up, up. Nice. I'm guessing there is a scroll behind here. There's not. I've been bamboozled. Uh, what are you, what are you doing? Where are we going? Running jump, Quill, running jump. <laughs> uh, oh, okay, I see it. It's on the uh, banister there. We're gonna have to do some wall crawling. There you go. So agile. What a mouse you are, Quill. Grab the lever. And then I'm guessing... Oh, okay. I see. Let's get this out of the way. Bring my little minion. How you doing, Mr. Minion? My name is the Reader, and I am your master. And away we go. Whoa. Quill was awestruck. Whoa. This was the legendary throne room. The same room where her uncle was once knighted by the king. Wow. Look at that. Okay, there are a ton of dead mice here, Quill. I'm not feeling very confident about anything. Alright, there's something here. I can do that. I don't know what the pink thing is. Can we do anything with the pink thing? Was there- did you have any, like, special abilities that I don't remember? Alright, let's move this back. There's a big old hammer thing here. I have no idea what that is. It, it, it. All right, that is nothing. There's a door. Ow, oh, ow, oh, come here, baby. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I did not mean to do that to you, uh, but I did find this little secret area in here, which I never would have seen if I hadn't mistakenly murdered you. Where are you off to? Oh, that is a cool throne. You gonna sit in it? You gonna sit in it, Quill? See what it's like to be the leader of the free mouse oh, world? Dear. Yeah. She called back to her uncle. Argus. For this moment. Yeah, get over here, buddy. That's good in this world. I hope it's still locked. Um. Oh no. We're back. Look at—we've already collected that much glass. Ha! The fools never figured it out. He snickered. <laughs> Uncle Argus then turned to Quill with a wink and a smirk, and plunged his blade into the throne. His sword was the key. Wow. Well, it's a good thing we didn't lose it. But the triumph soon faded as they descended into the eerie quietude of the secret chamber. Oh no. 
Please be safe. Her uncle pleaded under his breath, with an air of unease Quill had never heard before. Yeah, I have a feeling it's not going to be very safe. That is a cool room, though. Oh, uh, yeah, something bad has to happen, right? We're at the start of the game, not the ending. What is that? A voice barked back. I'd retreat if I were you. Dark, dark magic afoot here. One whip of my wand and a swarm of undead wasps will scour you alive. Oh my. That is danger. What? Her uncle laughed. <laughs> Barnard. Barnard. Don't tell me all this time alone has you communing with the dead. I... I don't have undead wasps. Total bluff. He chuckled. No, Barnard. My dear August, I can't believe it's really you. We did it. We found the secret. Were we searching for Barnard the entire time? I mean, he does seem like a really cool guy, and he definitely looks like a Barnard. But uh, I think we're still looking for something else down here. Oh, I'm so sorry, fretted her uncle. I tried to get back to you so many times. I just couldn't kill that vicious snake. Yeah, well, the I did. The long-awaited embrace was cut short. By what? August! Barnard panicked. What? I feel the reader's presence! Oh. The usurper followed you in! Hey, no, no, I'm a good guy. It's okay. No, Barnard! This is Quill, my next of kin and a twofold champion. They slayed Sawfog. That's right, baby. Holy whiskers on a weasel! Barnard was stunned. I... Oh, oh my. Yeah, I know. And there's much to discuss. Yeah, well, when you're standing Bogwart in front of a hero... Anyone? Oh my god, yeah, Bogwort tea sounds delicious. I'm more of like a chai or a matcha guy, but that is my third favorite. Barnard spent hours recounting his years in hiding, protecting the King's Glass from the Arcane. And with Sarpog dead, that winged tyrant will tear this castle apart. Winged tyrant? He knows one glass is here. Now two? This is bad. Very bad. Oh no. Not if Quill gets all five glass first, said her uncle with a grin. But, uh... Madness, Argus! That sounds Barnard difficult. Replied, <laughs> Even a twofold cannot take on their army. Not with a ward and forging screechers and scorchers and Arthur knows what. Yeah, I have no idea what those are, but I'm kind of freaked out. Oh man, Quill, we have a journey ahead of us. Hogwash! Uncle Argus retorted. Quill can handle that bloated behemoth after she rallies the Sprite army. Don't you see? Once we join all the glass, there will be no arcane. Even Vader will see it our way. She must. We could unwrite them all. Barnard mused. But Arnie, the truce states the glass must remain separate. Truce be damned. We need the remaining glass to restore peace. But first, Quill must rally the sprites. It's the only way. I mean, if anyone can do it, it's gonna be Quill. She is unstoppable. <laughs> Whoa. Dude. This is intense. Her uncle's belief in her and the reader swelled Quill's pride. They had a sprite army to inspire and the five glass to unite. And it all started with claiming the king's glass. But uh, actually, it really started with Quill destroying a bunch of ancient artifacts underneath the castle. Priceless vases and beautiful artifacts from Time Worn because Quill was a destructive mouse who craved nothing but the collecting of glass. Ah, uh, that's a creepy giant face in the distance. I don't want to know what is in the darkness. Don't stop now, Quill. We have a lot of shit to destroy. Oh, oh. Changed my perspective. That's how interesting. What is that? 
What is that, Quill? Um, I don't know if we're supposed to be here or not. Do we go in or should we get... The game won't let me progress without the king's glass, right? So this seems fun. Let's go into the darkness. I can't hear you! It's too dark in here! Uh, uh, a treasure chest, yes. We did it. Quill, we are so brilliant. Open that baby up. What is it? What is it? What is that? Is that armor? Do we have armor? Do I take it? How do I... What, what was that? I liked your little hands. I know that you know ASL, which is so cool. Okay. What? We can... Oh, that is so cool. Dude. Look at you. Do you feel a little more protected now? I kind of miss your green arm, but I like you. Looking like a knight? Yeah. Yeah, you're a badass. I wonder if we can get, like, helmets and other accessories. Oh, Quill, I am so excited. This is great. I am going to pimp you out into the coolest looking mouse anyone has ever seen. All right, let's go grab the king's glass, shall we? Oh, be careful, okay? I don't really trust this giant evil statue. Be careful, Quill. Just like Indiana Jones, okay? Ugh. Two down, three to go. Well, that was Black easy. Quill, excited by the adventures ahead. Yeah, me too. Ugh. Good job, buddy. Barnard was clear. She'd find quick passage to the sprites through the Room of Realms. Well, that sounds fun. Let's go there. I like that one little light. Perfectly placed. High five, dude. I am guessing that we have to go up these stairs here. You're getting a lot of exercise. Quill could see the green glow of the sprite realm radiating from the doorway ahead. Yep, no, I see it. Be very careful. Well, I am guessing that we're going to get some sort of power here in the sprite realm that will allow us to get these boxes. You can see there's like plants here. So maybe we have a way of connecting them? I don't know. Are you ready, Quill? Cool. Let's do it. Whoa. Uh, do we have another battle that we have to fight first? Was kind of hoping that would just take us straight into the sprite realm. But these holes in here tell me different. So many dead mice. Only sprites can cross here. Croaked an unseen voice. I have the green glass. Uh, yes. I'm your champion. We are the champions. Oh, fine then. The voice grumbled. Ugh. But no one here is calling you champion. Well, fine. Call me hero or something. Uh, there's like a, there's a scroll over here. Want to see if we can grab that before we leave? It did it. The, oh, come on, Quill. Gotta be a better jumper than that. Okay, can't get it yet. I guess I will open this door. I like the little elves. They look like the guy from Legend of Zelda. Oh. Well, that is intense. Are you ready? Yeah, my little champion. 